we are at the North Wales Tactical Gun Range, is mm -hmm. that what it is? Um, and you are going to see what I've been doing today, which is why I look like this. My name's Sam Logan, Royal Marines Commando, tour of Afghanistan, and now I've got a company called Complete Commando where we get people ready for the military. And my name is Ben Herbert, I'm the lead instructor and director of NWTGR, where we take the commandos and shove them through a CQD basis with an introduction to firearms. <laughs> this is Commando Lucy Davis, she's the newest recruit of the Royal Marines. The first woman. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So with this one, we can teach you how to manipulate it exactly as a firearm would. Okay. When we give you a rifle, okay, we have got three rules that you're going to follow fundamentally. Okay, there are there are nine in total for a gun range. But we're going to follow you. Th we're going to give you three to follow. We're going to make sure that it's either pointing at the ground or at the sky. Don't have your finger on the trigger. Definitely one of them. Trigger discipline. We're going to keep our finger above it at all times. So if I do this now, and you see push it to the bottom, and if you look on that side, you see a little red dot. Red dot means live. <laughs> Told you the long sleeve would be cool. <laughs> okay. If, okay, and I'm gonna go around the course relatively quickly, okay? So this is the sort of thing you're gonna do for your competition stuff, okay? So you're gonna come from here, you're gonna put your magazine in, you're gonna rack the gun, safety goes off, you're gonna take one or two shots at every target in your own time. So from here, Number nine. <laughs> Fucking hell, you're so fast. <laughs> kind of what I want you to do by the time. Yeah. Now, right, so what we're going to do is uh, webbing on, sandbags, uh, one in each hand. We're going to be running down to the bottom of the hill. This traverse is round. At the bottom, we're going to do one round of the pre joining fitness test for the Royal Marines. In between each station, we're going to jump over a wall, military style. Bergen back on, yeah. up this hill here. Over to the pull-up bar, max pull-ups. Bergen, uh, Bergen be down the side. Back here we've got another sandbag. Best effort down to the bottom. Another round, and then best effort back to the top. Timed. What can we get? You're the f you're going to be the first person to have done this, so you're going to set the mantle. Oh, am I? Yeah, yeah. yeah. And then we're wow. going to we'll have challenges and bring. All right, let's in. get our running shoes on. Right. Yeah. Three, two, one. Let's go. Well done. Good loose. Gets easy now. A bit flatter. Lovely work. Dump it down here by the Bergen. Good. And then front space. Nice flat space here. Twenty so breaths. Press ups. Yeah, that sounds. Good, quality work. Good, nice job. What do you mean? Jump over the wall. How? What do you go over that? Anywhere you want to get over it. Nice, good. And we're into 20 sit ups. Three, four, five, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Good. Back over the wall again, loose. And we're into 20 sit ups. Good. One, two, three, 13, 14, 19. 20 quality. Back over the wall, one minute plank to finish. Yep. Oh my one God. minute. This is where we control our breathing. Think about what we've got up next and try and relax everything, relax the heart rate. Do you get many girls doing this? As, yeah. as of uh, so far, no raw, uh, no girls have passed Royal Marines training. Fuck yeah. 30 seconds. So it was open to girls uh, for two years now, and so far, yeah, no, no one's passed. Three, two, one and we're out good okay webbing back on bergen on okay. i have to just hold it yeah, right. hey well done you feeling all right do you know what i felt better okay good we're seven minutes 30 in this will be the hardest bit in my opinion so as royal marines we're renowned for yomping that means going long distances with heavy kit yeah um one of our famous yomps was in the Falklands, where they had to yomp the entire Falklands Island 
to basically support troops in order to uh, retake the Falklands Islands. Island. Fuck. So it's a massive thing for us as Royal Marines. This is what we pride ourselves on. Yes. Ah, holy balls. Best feeling in the world, ditch the webbing. Nice work. Shake the arms out. How many pull-ups have we got? One, two, five, love that. Six. Stay with it, pry yourself now, that's where it counts. Nine, good, love that, love that. Let's go for it, 11. Get it done, get it done. We'll take that, get that water in. Give me sick. Oh my God. One round left, but no Bergen this time. Oh. Right, good effort, Luce. So the weight is the thing that catches most people out in Royal Marines training. 10, love that, good. 12, 13, 20, good. Sandbag over the wall, then yourself over the wall. Oh, sandbag. Good work. 30 sit ups. Four, five, six, four, 25, 26, 30, love that, well done. Sandbag back over the wall. Last little bit loose, absolutely smashing it. We're 16 minutes in. Good, right, 20 solid press ups. Good, one, two, three, four, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, quality. Back in, last one over the wall, into our plank. One minute. It's harder than 100k. Right, let's do it. Literally 23 seconds left. Fucking hell. Bum down, stay with it, Luke, come on. All the way through. We've got 13 seconds, right? Focus. Listen to my annoying voice. Three seconds, three, two, one, done. Well done. All right, last little bit. Webbing on, best effort back to the top of the hill. We hate the hill. We love the hill. What have you freaking got? Last little bit. We're on 18.43 right now. We've got 15 meters loose, let's go. Hey! Good effort, freaking amazing. Oh my God. I thought it'd be sick. Last round then. <laughs> Do you know what I planned now? <laughs> no thanks. I thought I was going over my head. That was so hard. So Royal Marines commando training is 36 weeks long. And uh, obviously I say lads so far because it's only lads who have completed it at the moment. But that's a snippet of the stuff they're doing throughout that 11 month period. And the weight just increases, the intensity increases. The, they're doing this lack of sleep, barely any food, pee wet through. Uh, sleeping freaking obviously out in the open and it's just it's, it's mind isn't it mindset that's what it all comes down to but freaking smashed it feel good oh my god <laughs> so little little couple uh, couple minutes just recover and then we're into the kill house and so we like target <laughs> that's it where's now. the target that's it so anyone can shoot fresh but now that we're freaking shattered can we still operate and can we still be a good soldier all right we that's can. what it's all about you got this, 100%. All right, let's go, kit back on. Kit on. Right, Lucy, it's gonna be a CQB lane, 10 shots, best effort. And then on the last uh, target, you're gonna do a transition and do uh, five pistol shots, all right? So it's a, t it's a total of 15. Then it goes. I feel it's number one. It's the holographic sight on. Little text on, yeah? Yeah, red. In your own time. Safety off. Three's around the corner, right in front of you. Hit four to your left. Five and six to your left. Turn to your right, number seven, directly ahead of me. Safety on. You 
you lost your light there because the gun was down into your chest, bring into your collarbone. Muzzle through, eight and nine. Nine, low and right. Nice, come back here. Take five shots walking forward, then stop static. Hit. Three, four, one more. Stop there, safety on, transition. There you go, recover, index finger, back and in. For her first time, that wasn't that bad. She's going to fall over though, oh you alright? There's a chair right there if you want to sit down. That was so excitingly, thrillingly, it's scary. <laughs> <laughs> There's so much to remember safety wise that it throws you off. So, just before this video ends, I wanted to see how well I had recovered after what I did yesterday. So, I've just woke up and I've just checked my whoop. My recovery is 39%. I don't really have 39% recoveries since after doing my ultra, which means I put my body through a lot yesterday. I popped screenshots on and I had the best sleep, which you can also see. And it's always, always, when my recovery is really low, I just, it's like I, it's like I can't get out of bed. Um, but it is so clever. I absolutely love my whoop. You guys know that I love it. And I've had it for like, I think like six or seven months now, which is, which is crazy. But you can get a free month on me and I'll link it below. I have just trained like a Royal Marine what? Commando. Commando. And it was the hardest thing that I have possibly ever done. Also the scariest because before this I had done clay pigeon shooting and I gave up. And I was really terrified and I hated it. But you were phenomenal. And no, but actually teaching me just mm. down, trigger, holding it, safety. And then when you know certain things, it's not actually as scary. Yeah, 100%. The, um, the fitness course was disgusting. Good. Like, a Good. But actually disgusting. And there's no women currently. None have passed yet. I mean, but also, I'm like, I'm How old are you? I'm 25. Yeah. Oh yeah, let's start. Let's start. <laughs> no, I mean, physically that is very demanding. Yeah. And also it's like the SAS where you have the same weight as the guys. Massive weight, yeah. yeah. So there's no, there's no, there's, There's no gender. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like whatever you've got to carry on ops is what you've got to and carry on And I do like ops. that because if, so say, because the way they described it on that SAS programme, if someone like died yeah, exactly. who's, or injured and you have to drag them, you have to do it whether yeah. you're a girl or a guy. But say, I appreciate that. Well, say me and you're on patrol and then I get freaking shot. Who's going to save me? Me? You've got to drag me out. <laughs> I'm going to drag you out. Exactly. Yeah, so North Wales Tactical Gun Range is the only one in the UK which do what we do. We specialise in the tactical movement side of it, practical shooting. So we specialise in CQB, firearms training, basic, hostile, level one, two and three. For people like yourself that are brand new into it, they give you just an introduction into firearms, but more from a practical point of view, from what the Royal Marines do, from what the Special Forces do. Um, as you can tell, you did the shotgun shooting from stood still. You point in the sky, you pull the trigger. You do the same with a lot of static ranges where you take a knee, you're prone or you stand up, which is what a lot of the basic training in the Royal Marines is all about. What we do is the more specialist stuff. Yeah. So a lot of the stress related stuff, uh, force on force stuff, we can touch on if necessary. But with the, facility, with the facility in here, what it's for is to give you experience that you won't find anywhere else. And it's to give people like yourself a little bit of an insight into having to move around with the gear and be accurate at the same time and Being follow all the safety rules. With it. You know, considering yeah. it's first time on this sort of range and you did all Good, that yeah, yeah, yeah. 20 minutes worth of This is from the professional dragging. There's still I'm work good. to be done, obviously. Like, obviously, but, um, God. We'll, we'll, we'll put it to the test now and we'll go and do it ourselves. <laughs> yeah, it can get bad. Um, but I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you in my next one. That was so hard. Like, unbelievable. I'm broken.